Hello, everybody. It's Congressman Jamie Raskin coming to you in Maryland's beautiful 8th Congressional District and all our friends beyond um, with my favorite time of the week, Local Hero. It's Friday, December 9th, and for Local Hero this week, we're getting to salute two Walt Whitman High School juniors, both 16 years old, Brian Mason and Ishwen Lee. These are my 2022 Maryland 8th District Congressional App Challenge winners. Their app called Clima gamifies carbon reduction with the creative user-driven experience. Clima rewards users for taking sustainable green actions in their homes and their communities, like recycling or washing laundry with cold water to earn points and care for a virtual sapling that grows as players complete green activities. They were inspired to create this innovative app to change people's daily habits to build a consciousness of climate change into everything they do. Both Ishwen and Brian have been coding for many years, <clears throat> and they run a business called Codosity, which offers online programming classes to kids in elementary school and middle school. They've already taught more than 50 students through this program. They also have a not-for-profit version called Code Up, where they offer free one-day lessons. Uh, to kids who are interested in it. So they are entrepreneurs, they are green activists, um, and they are local heroes for their uh, technological prowess and insight. Welcome, Ishwen and Brian, and congratulations on being local heroes. Yeah, thank you so much. Great to be here. All right. So, uh, Brian, why don't you start and tell us a little bit about the app that you guys won the competition with? Yeah, so we realized most of the efforts focused around environmental activism is narrowed around reducing emissions in large industries. For example, like the oil industry, you want to end fracking. Um, however, we feel like the root of the cause is what we want to try and change, and there's not many apps or technology built around uh, solving that. So we built Clima to try and change people's habits, as you said. And so, yeah, it's just as you said, you can complete tasks. Um, we have a list of like 90 different tasks you can complete, and they're structured so you can do them daily. And you get this like reward, you get experience points and you can level up your, your sapling. It starts as a, a seed and it goes to a sapling and then finally a tree. So, um, Ishwen, let me come to you. What do, if I wanted to get this, what do I put it on? Like on my phone or my computer? And is it, how difficult is it to manage it? Well, it's available on both um, iOS and Android mobile devices. So you can just download it straight from the App Store or the Google Play Store, either way. Cool. And then, um, but I, I mean, like, is it complex to use or am, am I going to be able to integrate it into my daily life? Well, I think it's a pretty easy to use interface. Like it's like any other app that you'll use, like Instagram or anything else. Yeah. Um, I'm surprised that that it, it didn't exist before because basically you're empowering people as individuals to take carbon reduction into their own hands and in their just daily life, right? Right, yeah. As we were researching what to, to topic to address, we decided to go on climate change. We did some research. We picked mobile apps and we found that, yeah, there was nothing else on the app store. So we decided to try and change that. Gotcha. Um, <clears throat> how long did it take you to design this particular app? Designing maybe a week, building like three months. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. And uh, you guys worked together on it? Yeah. Yeah. How many different apps have you guys created together? Uh, like five or six. Including websites. Yeah, including yeah. websites. Is that through a class at Whitman or are you just doing that on your own extracurricular? No, there's various competitions we enroll in and, and compete in. And I so see. Yeah. Um, uh, have you given up uh, on people like my age, like middle age people and older people i noticed that you're you're teaching just kids how to do it elementary and middle school kids um can adults learn how to do this too yeah, i think you can start at any age um we're targeting kids just because there's more of a niche there and there's a broader audience but if you're an adult go on youtube you can watch some videos it's not too hard to pick up <laughs> yeah yeah well look congratulations on uh, winning the congressional app challenge it's a big deal if people want to just get your app, they can just go to the App Store and download Clima, right? Yep. Um, and incorporate it. And are you guys doing it yourselves? Is it part of your, is it in your systems? 
Uh, yeah, I run That's the app, but we, we built it together. Yeah. Yeah. Well, um, it's a, a big step forward for um, the movement for climate rescue. Thank you for your attention to that. Thank you for what you're doing to um, spread code out into um, the new generations. Uh, that's a really wonderful thing. And uh, we salute you as our local heroes this week. Yeah, thank you so much. Thanks for having us.